While cats may seem indifferent to most of our behaviors, there are certain human actions that cats secretly hate, and it's crucial to recognize and fix them, as they can permanently damage the bond between the cat and their owner. So in this video, we'll be talking about 8 shocking reasons for which your cat may silently despise you. Number 1. Being teased. Cats are naturally curious and playful animals. When they see something moving, like a dot from a laser pointer, they instinctively want to chase and catch it. This chase is more than just play, it's a part of their hunting instincts. But if they never catch what they're chasing, they can become frustrated. It's like playing a game you can never win. Using a laser pointer to play with your cat can seem fun, and it's entertaining to watch them chase it. But it's important to remember that without a tangible reward, such as a treat or a toy they can physically catch, it can leave them feeling unsatisfied. Studies have shown that cats need a sense of achievement during play. When using a laser pointer, it's a good idea to end the game with them catching a tangible toy or treat. This gives them the satisfaction of a successful hunt. Teasing them with food can be equally frustrating. Pretending to give food and then pulling it away can be confusing and irritating to your cat. Number 2. Interrupted Sleep Cats love their sleep, in fact, they spend more than half their day snoozing. It's a vital part of their routine, helping them recharge and stay healthy. While it might seem cute to wake them up for a cuddle, repeated interruptions can make them grumpy. Just like humans, cats have sleep cycles. Disturbing them frequently can interfere with these cycles, leading to a tired and irritable cat. It's important to respect their rest and let them sleep undisturbed. If you've noticed your cat trying to find hidden or secluded spots to nap, it could be a sign that they're looking for a quiet place where they won't be disturbed. Ensure they have a comfortable quiet spot to rest without constant interruptions. Number 3. Dressing them up. Putting clothes or costumes on cats can be a popular trend, especially around holidays or special occasions. While some photos of cats in outfits can be cute, cats don't enjoy wearing them. Clothes can feel strange or restrictive to many cats. This is because they're not used to having anything on their fur, and an outfit can limit their natural movements. When cats communicate, they use their bodies a lot. Wearing clothes can hinder their ability to express themselves. It's also worth noting that cats regulate their body temperature through their fur. Adding layers, especially in warmer climates or seasons, can cause them to overheat. Number 4. Neglecting litter box cleanup. Cats are very clean animals. They spend a lot of time grooming themselves and they expect their surroundings, especially their litter box, to be clean as well. When a cat goes to use a litter box and finds it dirty, it can be very off-putting for them. Think of it as using a bathroom that hasn't been cleaned in a while, it's not a pleasant experience. A dirty litter box doesn't just smell bad. It can also be a breeding ground for bacteria. This can be harmful to your cat's health. If they find their litter box too dirty, they might look for other places in the house to do their business, which isn't ideal for anyone. It's a good habit to scoop out the litter box daily and do a complete change and clean regularly. This keeps the box fresh and inviting for your cat and ensures they have a hygienic place to do their business. A clean litter box also reduces odors in your home. Number 5. Overbathing. Cats are known for their grooming habits. This natural grooming keeps them clean and helps regulate their body temperature. Because of this, most cats don't need frequent baths like dogs do. When cats are bathed too often, it can strip away the natural oils from their skin and fur. These oils are essential as they keep the cat's skin moisturized and their fur in good condition. Overbathing can lead to dry skin, itching, and a dull coat. Moreover, the act of bathing is stressful for many cats. They may not like the feeling of water on their body. Forcing them into a bath can cause anxiety and fear, which isn't good for their well-being. It's best to only bathe your cat when absolutely necessary, like if they get into a messy substance. Number 6. Leaving them alone for extended periods. While cats are often seen as independent animals, they still need social interaction and companionship. They form strong bonds with their human family members and can feel lonely or anxious when left alone for too long. If you're away from home often, your cat can miss the usual feeding times, play sessions, and the general companionship that you provide. This change in routine can be distressing for them. 
Over time, loneliness can even affect their health and behavior. They might become withdrawn, eat less, or act out by scratching furniture or being more vocal. If you know you'll be gone for an extended period, consider getting a pet sitter or using timed feeders to keep their meal schedule regular. Toys, scratching posts, and interactive gadgets can also help keep them entertained when you're not around. Even with these measures, it's essential to spend quality time with your cat when you're home. Number 7. Playing rough. Cats are playful animals. They like to pounce, chase, and sometimes nibble during playtime. But there's a difference between gentle play and rough play. If you've ever had a cat swipe at you with their claws out or bite a bit too hard, you know what rough play feels like. Playing rough with your cat might seem fun at first. It can be amusing to see them get excited and playfully aggressive. But if this type of play becomes a habit, it can lead to more aggressive behaviors even when they're not playing. It's essential to set boundaries during playtime. Cats, especially kittens, learn through play. If they learn that biting or scratching is okay during play, they might think it's acceptable behavior all the time. To ensure your cat understands the difference, always use toys instead of hands or fingers for play, and if they start to play too roughly, take a break. A consistent and gentle approach to playtime helps your cat understand what behaviors are okay and which ones aren't. Number 8. Using Plastic Bowls the bowls you use for your cat's food and water might seem like a small detail, but to your cat, it can make a big difference. Some cats don't like plastic bowls. This dislike can be because plastic bowls can sometimes have a smell or taste that cats find unpleasant. Another problem with plastic bowls is cleanliness. Plastic can get scratches over time, and these scratches can become a place where bacteria grow. This isn't healthy for your cat and might even lead to skin issues around their mouth commonly known as feline acne. Many cat owners and vets recommend using stainless steel or ceramic bowls. These materials are easier to clean and don't hold onto odors. They're also more durable, which means they last longer and stay looking new. If you've noticed your cat hesitating to eat or drink from their bowl or if they seem to be eating less than usual, it might be worth trying a different type of bowl. Sometimes, a simple change like this can make a big difference in your cat's comfort and health. Cats often suffer from boredom and loneliness, but our feline companions are not very expressive, so we might not even suspect that they are silently suffering. So check out this video, where we talk about 8 signs your cat is lonely. And be sure to subscribe to our channel and join our feline-loving community.